This video will show how you can create a layered shader inside Houdini. Let's put down a shader ball into the scene, which we're going to put the layered shader on. There's a few options in the shader ball asset that shifts with Houdini. Hit the plus and minus keys to toggle subdivision display. And let's also turn on render with subdivision. Within the shader asset, there's a version with a seam, screws, or plain ball. We'll just be using the seams. Now let's put down a surface model material and apply it to the shell of the shader ball. Drop down a camera, lock and position it, and now we need a mantra wrap. We'll pin down the object one first, and then hit Ctrl and T or click on the plus thingy to make a new tab. Set it to Out. Hit Tab and type Mantra and select it. And I'm just going to make it smaller for the purpose of this video. Throw in an environment light. In the Render View tab, let's see what we get when we render it. That's the surface model material we applied. Let's jump inside and layer some stuff. Here are the VOPS nodes of the surface model material. We're going to create a layer mix node, which will allow us to blend things together. Middle mouse clicking on the parameters will give us access to shader effects, which are a library of nodes specific to shader building. Let's just rearrange the nodes to better see things. And now let's make our layer number two. We'll use a car paint shader. Lay out the nodes again with the L key. And now we need to put there an alpha so that we can see both layers. Let's put there a checkered pattern. So as you can see, the checkered alpha is layering the white surface model material with the blue car paint. We're going to change the size of the checkers and also tweak the car paint shader a bit. I'm going to make it yellow and put there some sparkly gold flakes. Change the size to 10. Frequency to 200, and reflectivity to 1. I'm just going to put it back to the smaller squares. The layer mix node allows us to mix infinite layers together. Let's put another one down. This time, let's put there a principal shader. We'll use the splatter pattern for the alpha this time. A little bit change the splatter shape, hit P again for the parameter pane. Change the principal shader color to a more slime green and put there some roughness. If we go back to the layer mix nodes, we can specify which layer we want to use instead of the blending of both. I can, for example, set the layer mix 1 surface blend to use only the sparkly gold flakes car paint. And that's how you can build up your layered shader inside Houdini.